welcome to London. Hey, welcome to this London vlog for you. Well, I'm going to be taking you around the tour of London itself. Ten seconds later. All right, here we are at the Big Ben. He's safe. We've been we've just put quite a busy day in London here. Uh, yes, you can see Big Ben. You can see the most famous building in London, as you can see right there. Very beautiful structure, as you would you would think of Big Ben anyway, and then. Uh, there we got Parliament Square. I zoom in now. Uh, yeah, that's, that is Parliament Square sign there. And let's move forward. Yeah, I'm with my mama and Maggie here. It's a busy, busy, beautiful day here in London here. This is the uh, Houses of Parliament here. You can see very famous uh, also a very famous part of London as well. Wow, it's busy here. Certainly busy here, and we've got some. I think that's a, I think that's a, uh, a famous building. I think that might be Westminster uh, Abbey. Yep, that's the one. Zoom it in a little bit for you to see. There we go. Uh, where the famous historical events take place there. It's a bit more calmer now. And it's not easy to do a blog around London, particularly when there's a lot of things in chaotic moments, but there we are. See you around here. Look at that. Glorious sight to behold. We'll have more things to do uh, for me to show you around London in just a moment. Oh, look at that. See, just walking past Big Ben now. A few moments later. Okay, here we are at Buckingham Palace in London. There we are. It's looking grand as always. Always. It's Buckingham Palace is where, uh, well, I guess the royal family sort of lives in and out of this building, basically. And it's also a very important building because that's where significant uh, historical events happened here uh, around the, over the last. Uh, hundred years or so shall we say and uh, it's a beautiful piece of structure which I can zoom in for you all the details you can see the uh, the emblem or the crest there you can see the flag up there the British flag up in there and then if we could just walk if we just uh, show you around what's happening here today look at that we have the mile over the horizon then we've got the Victoria Queen or the Queen Victoria uh, statue there, the sort of the the circle around the palace. That's wonderful. I assume that for you there. There we are. Very golden, isn't it? Lovely. I mean, wow. What a wonderful and a very beautiful place to do your tour of London. That is for sure. I'm loving it so far.
Okay, uh, here we are at our next uh, tour of London and just going to get some Jollibee now in Earl's Sports. Uh, I'll just flip it to you now. There we are, that's where we're heading now. So yeah, I'm feeling hungry. Ten seconds later. One hour later. Here we are at this very drizzly rain in London. Here we are approaching the Tower Bridge and then we have the Tower of London beside us here. We've got the uh, buildings up in there. So sort of the uh, the lovely structures there around. Oh, what a lovely day to be doing touring around London, that's for sure. I hope you're enjoying it so far. Uh, actually watching the my blog around this wonderful city of London. Although it's drizzling rain at this moment in time, uh, the Sort of the the uh, the journey and sort of the experience around it has been wonderful and very fulfilling so far. So I hope you enjoyed it. Five minutes later. Okay, here we are at the iconic Tower of London Bridge. Let's zoom in for you for details. As you can see. We have the England flag, we have the British flag, and then we have two very perpendicular, very similar towers that uh, imposes over the River Thames. What a beautiful part of London to visit in that way. So a lot of history that comes around it, and I think it's to do with a lot of you see around the River Thames. As you can see the boat cruising around, See the boat cruises, you can see that here over the horizon. Lovely Jabale. There we are, giving the horns. And then you can see on the horizon, you can see the Shard, which is the tallest building in London. Very imposing tower indeed. Lovely. All along this wonderful sunshine here today. What an iconic part of London that you should not miss if you ever wanted to go and visit London yourself. Uh, yeah, definitely want to put that on your bucket list, that's for sure. Alright, here we are ladies and gentlemen on another part of London. I am at the top of the Shard. Here we are from a first person view here of this wonderful, wonderful view around London. You can see the, the whole of it from bird's eye view. Now you can see the Tower Bridge. If I zoom that out for you, there it is on the horizon there. Then, you, then if I just sort of zoom it around for you, there's a battleship, a very old vintage battleship there. Then you can see the Tower of London over there as well. Wow. And then, then you see these all these clusters of these are uh, high-rising buildings there, including the uh, the Gherkin. If you could see it somewhere. And uh, yeah. That's the viewing around here in the shark. Okay, 
check it out. Look at the horizons over London. The sunset sets, starts to settle down into the evening. I'm looking at the, one of the most spectacular views in London. Quite a sight, isn't it? Okay, some more viewing from the shard, including London Eye on the distance, and you can see Big Ben and the House of Parliament just on the, the picture of the horizon. And then, if I just, if you can see the, uh, the, the beautiful sunset, first setting into the evening, and then we have the River Thames floating along. There they are. It's actually, it's actually spectacular, the view, you have to say. It's rather, it's rather invigorating to see. Quite enjoying this experience. There we are. Just want to get my thoughts on my mama. What do you think of the shard viewing? Do you like it? Well, <laughs> it's okay. At least. Um, you can see 360 degrees of London. Uh, well, I thought it's actually quite spectacular to say the least. Mm, I quite like it. The weather is good. I think so. I think you can see everything around London. I think that I think it's uh, it's incredibly uh, priceless of this experience. I'm quite loving it. I think it's worth the uh, worth the money and the experience for you to enjoy. If you ever want to go to the Shard, I would highly recommend it for you. Alright, here we are at Coburn Gardens. Here we are. That's a beautiful street, I have to say. It's the first time I've ever been to a Coburn Garden. It looks really lavish, to say the least. Quite liking it. It's also a very, you know, very uh, social-like kind of area where you could just hang out with your friends and family around here. It's actually quite nice. Okay, um, after a long hours of traveling around London, I uh, come to the, the part of the video where we do some conclusive um, evidence and analysis of London. Here with me, with my mama, what do you think of London today? It's not too bad, the weather is good, little grease on the brain, uh, it's good to go for a day. What do you think of all the attractions? Are they recommended? Yeah, there's nothing changed. So okay. It's the usual historical Buckingham Palace going down to Westminster Abbey, Ben, Big Ben. Yeah, like your usual uh, tourist attractions. Yeah. When you think of London, when you think of London, you think of history. And that's very evident in today's tour of London and myself and with my mama and Maggie. And, uh, we really enjoyed it and uh, I hope that uh, we'll do more adventures like that in the near future. So um, don't forget to leave a like, like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you all on the next adventure for you.
拜拜。